Hi there, this is Brandon Wilmarth with More Public Schools, and I'm going to show you very quickly how to use a MLA style formatting with Google Docs. So hopefully over the next uh, three minutes or so, you'll get a good idea of how quick and easy it is and really how similar it is to Microsoft Word. A couple differences, so that's what we're going to go over today. First and foremost, uh, looks like Word. Across the top, you have all of the tools like you do with Word. So we do as we do in Word, change to Times and 12 point font. And if we do all this before we start typing, it really does make our lives a lot easier. So change line spacing to double. And we're ready to start writing. So let's go ahead and knock our heading out. Remember it starts with the name, and then our teacher, and then our course, and then the due date. So this is going to be due February. 2015, so day, month, and year. And then again, just hit enter one time. Don't change up the spacing, don't change up the color or the font or anything. The only thing that we need to do is make sure that we center a line. So you can either hit Control Shift E or just hit this little tab. And then make sure you have an awesome title. Way better than mine right there. We'll go back and change that later. Always, always go back to left align. Don't type your body paragraphs with a center alignment. And we are ready to start typing our body paragraphs as soon as we hit tab. Or there's a little trick. If you can see the ruler, like I can, you see a little triangle and a little rectangle. So go to where you can select just the first line indent and then pull that over a half inch. There you go. That will make sure that everything that uh, every beginning of the paragraph is automatically indented. So now we have one last thing to do, and that's our header. Usually we just double click in the header with Microsoft Word, but we can't do that. So with Google Doc, make sure that you go to Insert, down to Header. And it starts with the left-hand side, and you can see how close it is to the top of the paper. So this is another little glitch with formatting with the Google Doc. Make sure that you get it down a half inch. And one really easy way to do that, hit Enter. And then we want to make it flush with our right one inch margin, so right align. Now we do need to change up our font to Times New Roman and 12 point to match the body of the paper. So we'll do that. Just your last name. Make sure everything is appropriately capitalized. Hit space and then if we type one, one will show up on all of our pages even if we have five pages. So make sure that you hit backspace and that you have your last name, one space and then go to insert, page number, and then top of page. At this point, you're ready to start writing the rest of your essay. Whenever you get to your MLA works cited or bibliography, I'll have another video for you to do that. So until then, happy formatting and good luck writing.